falongo. Falongo my out. Tama. Tina. I say I will talk to two boys. I say I will talk to two boys. 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 I I always have a desire to see the United States, the most powerful country of the world. You know, I, you know, growing up in the in the late 40s after the Second World War and going into the uh, the post-Korean War in 1950 and graduated from uh, Samoana High School in, in the early 60s. I always have that desire and I have two things in my mind. First, I like to go to school. If I can't afford it to pay for my own college education, then I will try to join the military and I have two branches of the service that I would like to serve at. Number one was the Air Force, number two was the Navy and then I went to the college in Hawaii and then I moved on to uh, San Francisco. I did drugs out there you know first week I came out I went up there I smoked ice you know I taste I tried cocaine you know, smoking weed. You know, after like five months, dude, I changed, man. I told him, you know, I was like, you know, I had to lay low. It changed my life, man. Because when I was doing drugs, man, every night, I don't sleep at night. You know, I always have to make an excuse, you know, I can take a car. During that time, I don't have a license, you know. The car got towed for like almost six days in two weeks, man. You know, I was taking back, I was like, man, this ain't working, you know? You gotta change. God came before you went in God, you can't hear you. You're a medical, you're a wife. You're a wife, you're a wife, you're a wife. You're a wife, 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 you're a wife. Ame A compear hoy a Melica ya, el ley hoy a Melica, el ley de con, el ley fue cupe maua. A que le fue pili, el ley de con, a un ya y Samoa ya, 
e mauale le, le kupe alofa mai nga kahoilele i lako nga alue nga e faia ko la vama ko e kupe nga e, 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 e ola e nga umula uma faofa o e siriaku nge mo i nga alako i oe e su, su i au le aso uma a e kerele o kupe nga ko e alu uma la o kupe le kong i grand Ya me ai kumai ki o le pidi o le ila me ne fapena. The reason why I came to the states, I thought that is better education. And when I came to the state, I was single. I was not even married. So I arrived in Hawaii, and I thought that's a life in Hawaii. But it wasn't. When my mom came here, she came back and she goes, "Let's move to San Francisco because my brother there and he likes us to move out there." So I decided to move here. It was very nice when we got here, but it's sad because my uncle is not that good. That was my mom's only brother. So we lived with him for two two months, and then the old man he's oh he's a drunkard. That the, the uncle my 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 mom's brother. So I start walking every day, start looking for a place to live. And we found this apartment, two bedrooms, $150, crack windows, and we have to move. No refrigerator, just a stove. And then I said to my mom, Mom, stay with your brother. I'm going to move with the girls. And my mom said, but do you think you can get it? Because I received unemployment at the time. That was 1968. And that time, I don't see too many Samoans around. And I cried day and night. I really want to go back to where, in Hawaii. But my mom is the person that keeps me here. 